I, I don't know if it's got if it's maybe got something to do with the fact that he was a defender himself, and that's kind of where he views the game from. Um, that that may have something to do with it. Uh, I think the job of England manager is also, you know, if you if you really want to keep it, you, you don't want to lose football matches, um, and that maybe uh, I think has an effect on the way that managers approach the games. Um, uh, and I think that might well be the case with Gareth. You know, and he's if he feel like the way that he's done it has been successful. That I think that's what he'll feel like because you know we got to a semi final the World Cup, we got to the final of the Euros. Um, and and it looks like it's a success the way that he's done it. Um, however, I think he's slightly deluded in that fact because when you look back at you know the runs that we had to get to those places, we didn't really kind of beat anyone of any significance along the way, uh, and we certainly didn't you know play teams off the park on a regular basis. So um, so I think that's probably why he's still sticking with. With doing it the way he's done it for the last eight years and and not really kind of been a little bit more positive i mean if you know those guys have uh spent hard-earned money to go and um follow the team uh and you know they were expecting you know as most of us were we were expecting better performances than we've seen so far um you know we, we've won one football match we've scored two goals um, and I think people just expected better. Uh, and I don't think, I don't think it's unusual. I mean, we, let's be honest, we were quite lucky to win the group given, you know, the, those statistics. Um, uh, and so I can understand why there was an element of frustration uh, amongst England fans. Um, but I think at the same time, you do have to, you know, look at it and say, okay, we've won the group. Uh, it's put us in a favorable half of the draw again you know, which we had uh, the last Euros, we had at the World Cup 2018. Um, so, you know, you could say Gareth's been, been very lucky in that regard. Um, we're playing a, probably going to play a, a Dutch team um, who aren't a vintage Dutch team, um, you know, just conceded three goals to Austria. So we might get lucky again and we might get all the way to the semi-finals or a final again before we come up against a decent team. Um, uh, and so, uh, I guess it's, it's a kind of a case of, you know, a chip and a chair, if you want to use poker expression, you know, we're in the tournament still, um, we're in the, we're in the fairer side of the draw. We've still got a chance, but given the performances so far, it would be, uh, quite an upset, I think, if we were to go and win it.